Hello again. Welcome back. Just got on Wonders World. Cheers. This will be out. This video. This one will be out after this one. Not giving anything away. This box of beer. Is it a bargain or is it not a bargain? $24.99 for 10 beers. Sumptuously wrapped. All 5, 6% ABV in one box. Available in a supermarket for the layman, me and you, to pick up. I think that's about it. I don't do videos like this. But I'm going to challenge somebody's point of view. Respectfully, I hope, but I am going to challenge it. I saw a video today from uh, a channel that I watch bits and pieces of. Um, I've become the L'Enfant Terrible of the YouTube beer community. And the rights and wrongs for that, I don't actually care, in all honesty. But if I see something that I think is off, I think I have the right to challenge that. Now, I saw a video from the Crummy Beard. Nice guy, Tom. Never had a problem with him. But I think he's wrong. And I'm going to tell you why I think he's wrong, actually. Because he's, um, he's put a video out that says, is this a bargain or is it over, something like, is it overpriced or something to do with little pricing? And then what he's done is he's, got some prices off the internet and said that he could have got, so this is twenty four ninety nine. he said he could have got them for £23.50, so £1.40 cheaper. I don't see that as a bargain either, to be fair. And also, what I don't think Tom's taken into account is, yes, in Germany, you could probably pick up these beers individually for, I don't know, a euro, Say two euros, absolute max. Let's go for two euros max, maybe three euros max. So you're looking at 30 euros, which is going to bring you down to 23 odd quid. But, and there's a big but, if you were to bring these beers in to the UK, then they're going to get taxed higher. So let's, let's go for Schneider Weiss, which I've just reviewed. You're looking at two pound fifty a bottle on that. If we if we're going to even them out at two pound forty nine a bottle, two pound forty nine point nine 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 recurring. Schneider Weiss Fest beer or Weiss beer available in this country individually. I don't think you're going to get for less than about four quid. Hofbrau Oktoberfest beer, I would say, is probably the same. I don't pretend to be a beer expert or a fountain of beer knowledge, but you're looking at eight quid for two beers, which is leaving you, what's that, 17 pound for the other, sorry, for the two beers, so 17 pound for the other eight. If you're looking at three pound a beer, three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 24, 27, you're looking at 35 pounds per beer uh, for, for the box. I think this box, is tremendous value you also if you were to if you could get all of these in one place you would have say they were all available on trembling madness you'd have postage of packaging uh i doubt it would come in this big box now am i going to keep the box maybe i might keep this part and put it over there uh but i think to say it's not a bargain, I think that's wrong. And it's a little bit clickbaity. Now I'm all for clickbait if I'm honest. Um, it brings people to the brings eyes to channels and I've got no problem with that. But I think on this occasion the maths doesn't add up because you pick in individual bottles that aren't available in the UK anyway, so you'd have to have them imported, then they're going to be hit with tax, etc, etc, etc. So, 
for, for, for anyone to say or question whether that's a, a bargain or not, and it, it all depends whether you've got twenty four ninety nine to spend on 10 beers as well, in all honesty. Um, but for me, I think it is a bargain. And I think the... Obviously, they're not Oktoberfest beers. They're fest beers. They can't call themselves Oktoberfest because some of these breweries aren't within the rules of, uh, uh, within the city of Munich. I think that's how it works. Again, I don't profess to be any sort of beer expert. Um, and I'm hoping this doesn't come across as a fucking nasty video. I don't intend it to be. I just, I saw it and I just thought, oh, that doesn't sound right. And I should be able to, I should have the ability to challenge something um, that I don't think is right. And I don't think that that video is right. Um, because even with the calculation of £23.59 or £49, £1.50 is negligible in these days. Um, also, as a layman, picking, being able to pick up 10 beers, it doesn't, even if they are not all fantastic, this one is fantastic. No doubt, and I know Tom's re reviewed uh, Hofbrau um, Oktoberfest beer. I haven't seen the review. I'm assuming that would be fantastic. Hofbrau or HB are a fantastic brewery anyway. Um, the others, I ain't got a fucking clue about. I'm not going to sit and lie. But the other thing is, I think that there's a couple, one of a few things have happened with Lidl. They've either, they've either bought an absolute ton of this and got them dirt cheap and are making a huge profit. They might might have paid the import uh, the the tax on them to get him in at that price, or they're just they're losing so much money on this thing. It's incredible. I don't know which one it is. Um, but I'm interested in your thoughts as well. Am I wrong? I might be wrong for challenging something that I don't think is right. Um, am I wrong to say that I think? And I'm going to go out and I'm going to say this very confidently from my point of view. I think this is the best thing that Lidl have ever put into a supermarket without even trying the beers because they've been, all supermarkets have been attacked for not trying on certain things. Lidl got attacked for their fest beer last year and, and some of it's crap and they've gone all in. And I think that, I think that, I think that deserves some, some praise actually. Um, it's a price not everybody's going to be able to afford it. Wanda looked, looked at me as if I was going fucking mental. Um, but I think at £2.49 a bottle, I think it's tremendous value. Um, but what do you think? Am I wrong? So I'm not trying to start a war or anything like that, but I should be able to address things that I think is wrong. They won't fucking... They, fucking, um, they don't recognise me anyway, so I don't really care in, all great, in a great scheme of things. But yeah, um, interested in your thoughts. Is it a bargain? Is it not a bargain? Am I right? Is Tom Wright interested in your thoughts? Leave a comment below. Um, interesting. Um, if you like the video, get a thumbs up. No, get the thumbs down. There's a subscribe button over there somewhere. We want to see you soon.